Chelsea Handler's comments about 50 Cent during her interview with Jimmy Fallon have resurfaced, igniting a wave of outrage. Handler's assertion that 50 Cent should not support Donald Trump because he is a black man has drawn significant backlash. You heard about my ex-boyfriend, right? 50 Cent and his support of, of, of uh, Donald Trump. Yeah, what's going on between you? I, I saw your tweets and I go, wait, what's happening? Because you said he was your favorite ex-boyfriend and then he, what does he do? He's supporting Trump? He says he doesn't want to pay 62% of taxes, which, by the way, isn't a plan of Joe Biden's. That's, that's, that's a lie. So he doesn't want to pay 62% of taxes because he doesn't want to go from being 50 cents to 20 cents. <laughs> and, I, and I had to remind him that he was a black person, so he can't vote for Donald Trump and that he shouldn't be influencing an entire swath of people who may listen to him because he's worried about his own personal pocketbook. So I haven't heard back from him yet, but I, I am willing to you know, seal the deal in more ways than one if he changes his mind and publicly denounces Donald Trump, I might be willing to go for another spin, if you know what I'm talking about. <laughs> in our society, personal freedom, including political choices, is paramount. Handler's implication that 50 Cent cannot support Trump due to his race undermines his autonomy and freedom of thought. The right of every individual to make political decisions without succumbing to racial or social pressure is a core value. The notion that race dictates political loyalty contradicts conservative beliefs about individual freedom and self-determination. Handler's offer of personal incentives in exchange for political compliance appears to disregard 50 cents integrity. Criticizing the use of personal influence to sway political views, these tactics are seen as morally questionable and detrimental to genuine democratic dialogue.